Hello everyone, this is your girl Ruth Watts here. She's back with a new video. And please, if you're new here, or this is your first time to see this uh, channel, consider subscribing. <laughs> and if you don't want to miss any of my video, the comedy, fun video I always post from my TikTok, guys. So that every time I upload it, you will manage to see it. Huh? So you can also follow me on uh, TikTok. I'm Ruth Watts on TikTok. Yeah, here on my channel, I'm Ruth Watts TV. Yeah? Facebook, I'm Ruth Watts. Hmm? IG, I'm Ruth Watts IG underscore IG. Okay, guys, today's topic is about. I want to address our parents and uh, not all but kunao some of them ambao bado hawajafunguka kwa watoto wao and uh, the issue is concerning the kids where guys it's not fair what is happening to our kids and no one is willing anything but to happen to them but again i myself i see sometimes uh parents wanna wanafanya hii kitu inakuwa inakuwa a big issue to our to their kids or rather our kids because some parents they don't have um, confidence huh? they don't have that confidence to face their kids and teach them one two three okay uh, comparing the kids of nowadays and uh, Kamasisi Kamasisi those days we are ain't same things are totally different huh? so like uh, even if you don't teach your kid social media is there for them these kids they have accessibility of media they are exposed to media than us you see our days we were not that much exposed to media and media can feed anything to your kids huh? concerning to what the kid is typing or concerning to what the kid wants yeah so it's depend on you parents to know what kind of a contact these kids are watching what kind of uh ile mambo hawa watoto wanaji associate nayo you see because nowadays some of the parents they, they fear they have that fear sitasema eti ama ni walaumu but some of them bado wako na ile fear because like uh, kama ni sisi tukilewa tukua wales uh, you could even fear to uh, to go and approach your mom or either your dad unaona so apparently things zilikuwa hard kwetu mambo zingine hatungeweza ku, ku approach wazazi wetu because ulikuwa una fear if i go to tell my mom this maybe nitachap or from nothing yani ulikuwa tu kitu hata you could see even mtoto ametoka umetoka kucheza by the time you are coming back you are trying to hide yourself from your mom not to see you so that uh, isikuwe oh umejipaka uchafu ni wewe na mimi unachapwa unaona so such things they don't uh, exist nowadays i don't i don't think bado ziko nowadays because kitambo tulikuwa we were used to being beaten and all that unaona so parents kuna mambo ambayo inatendeka up to date ambayo sisi as a parents tunaweza yazuia tunaweza zuia mambo zingine kama hizi because I feel bad whenever I come across uh, story ya uh, rape. Unaona? Una unashindwa vitu zingine mtoto mbibia na anajaribu the way atakuelezea but you are not taking any caution about it. You are not there is no step. 
unateka pauli tunona so it's end up unapata huu mtoto ile time kitu imemhapenia that's when you are coming like you are coming out being like yani like oh and my baby has been telling me this and this and this you get me so this is not right this is not right it is not right hmm? it is very fine to sit down with your kids elazem total and one thing i will just nitakanya wazazi one thing i will beg you for real stop telling these kids stop uh, introducing at because this person tunajuana for long because so and so tunajuana from home ushago and all that so and so tunajuana kutoka job and you know such stuff huh? and then you just come and tell you just come and introduce to your kids at this is your uncle mhm this is your uncle Wazazi, stop that thing. Because one thing I realized when you introduce someone as an uncle to that kid, hmm? and I'm not, uh, Mimi, I'm not of, I'm not in uh, like specific, specific gender. It is a boy or a girl. All. Because even nowadays, not not only nowadays it's it's uh in if it was it was the major talk exactly like the way to nazielewa for now because at a vijana wame kwa kipitia such things na ni vila wako wanazieleza some of them wako wanazieleza and it's even hard for them it's a nature of a man i think so who come up na kujieleza you see but if it's a woman or a lady it's easier kwa kujieleza so guys i was uh, i was giving this point of uh, introducing what to see am kwa watoto kwa wao because me as i was young okay when i was young if someone was introduced to my parent like an uncle, I could find myself so attached to that person rather than who mtu mwingine na jua tu ni ni mabeshi tu. You get me? So guys, and I don't say being with an uncle, a real uncle for that uh, kid, it's also safe. We can see nowadays even their own father, the biological father. Hmm? mambo ambazo wanafanyia watoto pia so this is to address parent you must stop this this fear must get to an end huh? it must get to an end in order to save our kids this must get to an end huh? and chukweni watoto wenu nyinyi wenyewe jifunzie mtoto don't say it is shule wanafunzwa mm don't say so chanya utafunza mtoto atagrow akijua this is what my mom told me or taught me or this is what my dad taught me you see lakini ile ya shule yes that i get but haitaingia kama yako mzazi ondoa hiyo aibu on to you are ipo it is hey i don't know what my kid will say i don't know what my my friend social media is here for them huh? these kids they can watch anything anything hmm? what when you to know nyumbani pia they can do anything to our kids and i'm not appointing to any person but to me on a vile mambo zinatendeka ya anyone can be possible for anything you get me so no one wish bad luck to our kids no one totally no one but parents like now shule zimefungwa this is the hard time unapata vitu shit shit are happening huh? 
na for me nikisikia tu mtu huyu ametendekewa ni kitu i just feel i just feel ni kama mimi such that e kitu itani happen yeah, but i feel it's like ni mimi na mimi ni mtu mzima you get it so you can imagine the trauma huyo mtoto anapitia na wewe itakuhapenia how much it damage your mind huh? na huyo mtoto ama huyo mtu hata watu wazima um, you can see huh? how they get traumatized huh? na mambo kama hizi huh? this is not the time to keep quiet parent Mm-mm, this must stop parents let's do this please let's do this huh? let's come up together and even if see where we now you have a friend that can address or or either can uh, teach your kids one two three let those kids to be close to that friend hmm? at least even that kid will come and tell you hey until tell you tuambia hivi na hivi na hivi ni tufunza hivi and you utapata ume open up sasa ume umeanza kuwa open to that kid and you will tell you will add something from that unaona and one thing parents be a good friend with your kids be a best friend to that kid be a mother be a sister and be a friend to that kid whenever you are, you are whenever those three things are combined huyo mtoto hataja kudanganya anything huyo mtoto hataja ku yani kwa ile anajiwekea mambo you get me so parent it's up to us yes it's up to us because we can see whatever is happening to this society yeah so it's up to us we address our kids either be it a boy or a girl we must talk out we must speak out yeah so if this video will reach out to you na unakuanga ile hauna ile confidence ya kuongea na watoto already you don't know how to start you don't know how to begin it If you have a friend you trust you can even be fair kifunza huyo mtoto do it usinyamaze usinyamaze and if you are a mother to that kid miss yoni hiyo hayo unafaa kuwa nayo Mm-mm. please usinyamaze wote tu save watoto wetu manze mwambie hmm? mami ama baba dudu yako ifai kuguzwa ni anyone no one is supposed to joke around with your dudu huh mwambie vizuri if anyone try to touch your private parts mm mami or papa usinyamaze kuja uniambie kuja uniambie immediately just report the matter to me na wewe kama mzazi usiogope ila huyu mtu ana pesa ila huyu mtu anakaa nani usiogope bring it out because kunyamaza kwetu imefanya vitu zingine zinakuwa pile unapata zimekuwa wasi hmm? tuna pile ma vitu tu hivyo and then we find out that kama hiki kitu ungeongea mbi kuna mtu angekusaidia unaona so guys Thank you so much for your time and uh, consider subscribing. Huh? Thank you so much so much. I'll be bringing more of this. So until next time, cheers. I love you guys.